Home in Node B, in addition to the issues such as coverage, connectivity, services, etc., also provides some additional features which allow the traffic to go through vertical handoff, horizontal handoff, and local termination. There are some interesting concepts known as LIPA and SIPTO, and we are going to talk about these through an illustration. Consider a home or office environment where we have a home in node B. This home in node B is providing access to the user equipment or the mobile terminals. The primary traffic route that we very naturally expect is towards the internet. However, the traffic is routed through the serving gateway and the packet data network gateway, if you recall. It means that the home in node B is acting typically as an intermediary between the user equipment and the serving gateway in the case of EUTRAN. There are certain examples of situations where this may not always be the case. The first one is the locality of the access. Locality of the access actually means that the sender IP address and the receiver IP address actually belong to the same network address. It means the traffic is going to be sent locally. For that, Home in Node B provides a mechanism known as the local IP access or LIPA. What happens here is that the traffic is sent from the mobile equipment to the other side of the network. It could be a server, it could be another mobile phone within the home network, or if it's an organization, an enterprise network. But this traffic is, since local, it need not go to the serving gateway and the packet data network or the packet gateway. Instead, it would be routed locally. In order to assess that this traffic has to, has to terminate locally, the signaling has to be done through the evolved packet core infrastructure. The mobility management information, the handover information all needs to go to the core network. In addition, we have another important concept known as SIPTO, that is selected IP traffic offloading. Offloading actually means to take this traffic off from the mobile operator's network and instead send it to any other ISP through any other kind of broadband connectivity. There are certain rules and certain conditions which allow a mobile operator to let its home in B implement SIPTO and there is a conf configuration requirement that is needed on the user equipment side to implement SIPTO. We'd look at it one by one. So first, let's conclude LIPA. The primary advantage of local IP access means that since the network address could be the same, so the traffic need not be routed through a hierarchical traversal. That means the traffic has to be kind of freely transmitted. It means the tariffs and the mobile operator service charges should be applied in a different and subsidized manner as compared to the traffic that goes through the uh, evolved packet core. Since the data traffic is being prevented to enter into EPC, so this allows home in node B to act more like an anchoring point and helps the overall complexity be relieved from the EPC servers. Since the identification of the IP addresses has to be done from the core network side and the mobility management etc has to be managed effectively and correctly. So the signaling has to go to the, to the core network 
to respective um, servers for management and for signaling. As far as SIP2 is concerned, this allows the access of the user equipment to a certain IP network. This could be the public IP network, it could be a specific um, um, private IP network, that means it is an extra net. So, it means specific requirements have to be fulfilled in order for the home in node B to support SIPTO. The first one is the mobile operator has to agree to it. The second one is the mobile operator has to make sure that the user equipment has the necessary hardware and software arrangements to implement it. And the third one is that a proper identification mechanism has to exist that understands the nature of traffic that is either going through the uh, mobile operator infrastructure which is a very typical way or if it is SIPTO traffic.